Hey traders, I hope you're all doing well. So before I start my video, let me tell you that if you have any questions regarding any trading or entries, you can always DM me on Instagram because in that way I can answer you much quicker than emails. And right here we got a nice trade out of natural gas as expected. Yesterday we had a nice fall out of our major area of value. So let me show you what I've said in my yesterday's video so that we can understand the way we take entries and what to expect next. I have personally entered this trade as well as you can see right here. You can see the sign. This means I am in this trade. The target for me is 8.372. We can expect a push up from 50 EMA as well. So if you want to exit here at 50 EMA, that's totally up to you or manage your positions. Okay, awesome. So we took an entry here on one hour time frame right here with this nice engulfing candle and as you can see we had a nice push down i was expecting market to hit 50 ema to exit your trade but my target was a bit more bigger and as you can see the full target has been hit as well 50 ema target has been hit as well and that was around 60 pips here and that was around 5 atr target that was a good trade for natural gas and i hope you got some nice profits here if you had and then make sure you hit a like button for me and if you're new hit a subscribe button and let's trade together so what to expect next from a natural gas at this point as you can see the market has broken below 20 ema it has not broken here on currency.com we're going to go through that as well so now as you know the market is in an uptrend our take profit has been hit now if you see this next candle this four hour candle if that candle will close above the previous candle that will become an engulfing candle and in an uptrend if i see this type of move then i consider is at a bullish move then that is a sign that market can likely to push back up and if that happens we can have a nice double top entry so keep an eye here if it close above this previous candle then that will be a bullish sign but looking at the bearish pressure at this engulfing candle as well this four hour candle pushes down and it won't close as an engulfing candle then i'm expecting a, a gas to hit this next zone which is 8.052 goes down to 7.771 and as you can see we got this 50 em support as well at our support level adding all the confluence that we if we push down if the market closed below this 50 ema then we can good to go till 50 ema so keep an eye here on the charts. I'm sure you guys have exit your trade. If not, it's a good point to exit and look for the next reason. Here on currency.com, as you can see, we did not get any sort of engulfing candle, but we do have this 3A2 candle that happened above 20 EMA. Now again, if you see an engulfing entry on Oanda, that's a bullish sign. And if you see any sort of engulfing candle here, that's also a bullish sign. So keep an eye there. If we are broken and closed below, 50 EMA let's say if this candle that closes below 50 EMA then we have a good chance that we can hit this next level of support here which is 7.881 goes up to 8.195 and if that happens I'm expecting market to hit 50 EMA here on currency.com so I have these zones on your chart if you're broken below 20 EMA here then there's a chance we can hit 50 EMA on or this zone right here. it's still bearish we still see a good bearish pressure looking at this engulfing pattern looking at this minor double top here on four hour as well expecting a good push down unless and until we get a reason to enter by trade if we get a good buying engulfing candle like we are getting on oanda let's check gold gold is still just ranging here i'm just going to give you the level to take your sell trades right here the level above is 1743 goes up to 1747 so if you have a push up here because we are above 50 ema then there is a chances that the market will push up now because we are above 50 ema we have this pin bar here and if this candle closes here and we have a next candle that closed above this zone then we can see a push up and from 1743 i will look to take my sell trade so i won't be entering gold because we have no entry reason but i would like to enter gold once we hit here this yellow zone once we hit the yellow zone we'll look for a sell trades let's check crude oil same here on crude oil market inverted head and shoulder pattern this is pushing up and down so have this level of resistance 103.720 goes up to 106.3 uh, 106.034 if you have a push up this is a zone you need to exit your trade if you are in a buy trade then this is a zone you need to exit from where i will look for a nice reason to enter sell trades so i have these zones 
on your charts so that's all for commodity market guys any questions dm me on instagram i'll get back to you asap hope you trade green rest of the week see you guys in the next video till then take care